Hi, so this is our video number six. So in this video, I'm going to show you uh, how to create the goods receipt. In our previous video, I have created the purchase order now with reference to that purchase order. Next, we will uh, add in the system that or we will proceed with our goods receipt with reference to purchase order. Let's do that. So let's next I'm going to do the SAP screen and we will create one goods receipt with reference to our previous created purchase order. Now you can use here the transaction code MIGO, M-I-G-O, or you can also use the navigation. So one option is MIGO, right? This one you can use here, or you can use here the navigation, system navigation. So it is there in your, again, logistic, then go to material management, then go to inventory management, then go to goods movement and goods movement. So what we are doing here, we are doing the goods receipt, GR, goods receipt with reference to purchase order. So you need to have the purchase order. So you, you may, uh, you can search the purchase order. So the last purchase order, whatever we have created, you can search it. So this is our purchase order and we can copy it and directly we can paste it here. Search. Now all the details, whatever earlier it was there in our purchase order, so all the informations we are going to get from our previous purchase order. So with reference to the purchase order 35, which I created in my previous video, so all the informations are there. It is the same material, material number 60. What is the quantity? 100 units we are going to purchase uh, in this plant and warehouse. And this is our pure data. This is our supplier. This is our vendor. So all informations are ready and click on item OK. So there is no error. Next, we will proceed with post. So once we'll post it, then successfully we will complete the GR post. So goods received and this material document is generated and note this number with reference to this number. Next, we will do the accounting analysis. So this is our goods received number. So we have successfully completed the goods receipt in our next video we will analyze this goods receipt and we will see the accounting impact thank you